Assalamu alaikum everyone. What's new with the Arab world? There's a proposal to cut all diplomatic and economic ties with Israel, to deny the Arab airspace for the Israeli flights, and that the oil producing Muslim countries should threaten to use oil as a means of leverage. Why are they doing this? Obviously, because to achieve ceasefire in Gaza, that is murdering Palestinian child every 10 minutes. So this is the sanction part from Boycott Divestment and Sanction BDS and seven countries rejected this proposal to cut ties economically and diplomatically with Israel. Who rejected this? Saudi Arabia, UAE, Jordan, Egypt, Bahrain, Sudan, Morocco, Mauritania and Djibouti. What is wrong with you people? I'm not sure if this video will reach citizens of these countries these seven countries please if you see my video you have to do something you have to pressure your government to do something more i do not know how but you have to do something people are still being butchered every single day and remember every 10 minutes Gazan children are being murdered right now and mind you if you are muslim or you are christian or you are human Palestinian in Gaza, they are starving, they are starving, they are starving. While being starved, they are being butchered, they are being murdered, they are being bombed, they are being forced to leave their homes on foot while being watched by the Israeli soldiers. And we, we have to do something more. 57 Muslim nation countries attended this summit. And if nothing is being done, I mean like, what's the use? I just don't understand why these countries still not unified, still not having the same voice about stopping the genocide. Like, you guys still want to have something to do with Israel. Shame on you guys.